Hi, my name is Rochelle, and these are our three to read, the three books we picked for you to read this week. Our hot pick of the week, and the one that's on the tip of everyone's tongue, is The World According to Fanny Davis by Bridget M. Davis. This book takes place in Detroit in the 1960s and 70s, and it follows the life of Davis's mom, who had an underground lottery business to help take care of her family. We think this book is the perfect hot pick of the week because um, tomorrow starts the Black History Month and it also showcases the life of a strong, powerful African-American matriarch that you definitely want to check out. Our coffee shop read of the week is 99% uh, Mine by Sally Thorne. This romantic novel follows the life of Darcy who's been in love with her twin brother's best friend Tom since the age of eight, but has been told from the get-go that Tom is off limits. Um, this book then fast forwards to a couple decades later when the twins acquire their grandmother's old rundown cottage and Tom comes over to help fix it up. Uh, Darcy falls back in love with Tom and that's when this book heats up. We think this book is the perfect coffee shop read of the week because it is cute and it's romantic and it's the perfect book to read around the Valentine's Day time. So definitely check it out. <laughs> Lastly, our Dark Horse read of the week is The New Rules of War by Sean McFate. This book takes the theories of war from the past and the present and applies these same theories to the future to see how one can win wars. We think this book is a perfect Dark Horse read of the week because Sean McFate is a war veteran and he has also had a PhD in international relations from LES. We think, um, so if you ever need any advice on wars and how one must maneuver in wars, this is the guy you definitely want to check out and this book is something that you definitely want to check out. So these are our three to read. Let us know what you think about each and every single one of them and if you plan on checking any one of these out. Thank you so much.